Hi, I'm Janae from Mahalo.com, and I'm going to teach you how to make a gimlet. When you hear the word gimlet, it basically just means with lime and tonic water. So you can choose to have a vodka gimlet, we could use some vodka, or you can choose to have a gin gimlet and use gin. You can also choose to have a gimlet on the rocks, in a rocks glass filled with ice, or up in a martini glass. Today we're going to go ahead and make it on the rocks, but it's completely up to your choice. What you need to do is get a shaker, fill it with your ice, and go ahead, stick some lime juice in there. About two slices is pretty sufficient. You're going to want to put about an ounce and a half to two ounces if you want it a little stronger of vodka or gin. Today we're going to go ahead and use vodka. And then a splash of the rose's lime juice. I like to use fresh lime and rose's lime juice. That way you get a little bit of the sour from the real lime and the sweet because the rose is a little bit sweeter than just regular lime juice. It's a good mix. Go ahead and fill this with some more ice. So good ice. We're going to go ahead and shake this all together. All right, now we have our vodka and our lime juice all mixed. You may be wondering why I chose not to put the tonic water in there. This is sparkling, it's bubbly. So anytime you have soda or champagne, anything fizzy at all, you don't want to shake it in the shaker. It'll make the shaker explode. It doesn't work well. So you have to actually just stick that in last, like a splash. So now we have our lime juice and our vodka. I'm just gonna leave a little bit of room, just a tiny, tiny bit of room to splash the tonic water on top. So now our tonic water's there, garnish it with a lime, and your gimlet's all ready to be served and enjoyed. Thanks for watching. To learn how to make more drinks, check out these other videos.